barbershop conversation, guys, feel free to hit the subscribe button, man. Breaking news, man. I read this article, honestly, when I got off the plane at Jared Hurd's uh, fight two weeks ago. Literally, when I got off the plane, someone emailed me this article, and I forgot to report it. I just got to, got to finish talking to Black Fight Fan. They reminded me of this. The Zone only made $14 million in America last year. $14 million. I'm going to read some of the article for you guys. So you guys, and these are all quotes. This ain't no Fred making numbers up, but they only made $14 million last year. I'm going to put the article in the description box. But I want to read I want to read where it says about America. I'm not going to read the whole article to you guys. Let me find it. Uh, okay. In addition, the zones, it, 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 it's... it's the article is literally, it's pro the zone, which is no big deal. You know, everyone has a side, side of the fence that they climb on, so no big deal. So let me read it to you. But you'll get lost in translation if you don't understand the context of the article. But I'm going to explain it to you. In addition, the zone saw incre increases in income generated across the globe from 2017 to 2018. In Asia, the growth was more than, more than $65 million, and all this is in U.S. money with the region accounting for 42% of all companies' revenue. Euro, Europe accounts for 44% of all platform streaming sales. And the North America region also saw its turnover grow five folds up to $14.3 million. And you can go on and read the article. So, so, so let me get this straight. So if uh, Europe accounts for 44% and Asia accounts for 42, that makes 86% of their market share. In terms of revenue, in terms of gross revenue, so that means there are only fourteen percent left, and America probably makes probably less than one percent of that. Because remember, what did they say? Nor oh, North America. So that means Mexico, Canada, and America. So excuse me. So you know, <laughs> the zone isn't doing so well. So I would honestly say, not out of arrogance, but out of protection. Um, if you have a contract with the zone, make sure you have a lawyer in hand because if they fold. Or if they sell pennies on the dollar, that you may have to restructure your contract. And I'm uncertain if your contracts are guaranteed, but this is the article that's been reported. And uh, um, these are the facts. So, uh, Eddie Hearn, you got a lot of explaining to do next week. I want to see if any any uh, any newspaper writers or any YouTubers or just media in general will bring up this, this article. They only made $14 million last year. Go figure. So anyways, man, barbershop conversations, man. I told you that this was coming. I told you this this day was coming. So, uh, and, and, and the reason why, they didn't embrace America. They came over here with the wrong intentions. John Skipper, see, here's the catch. John Skipper wanted to dethrone ESPN, and, and Eddie Hearn wanted to dethrone Al Heyman. Good luck. <laughs> barbershop conversations man feel free to subscribe button enjoy the article i'm gonna put it in the description box and talk to you guys soon peace